Award, and this is Artistic Expressions, and we're here in McGuffey with two wonderful artists from Rwanda. And Emmanuel, tell me your last name. Moranga. Moranga, mm -hmm. and Innocent. Moroses. And, uh, uh, Noroziza. No, no yeah. Ah, oh, I got it. Got it. Yeah. Okay, so you have an exhibit here, and I'd like for us to just kind of take a look at the, the paintings, and maybe you can explain to me what they're all about. Yeah. And you, you said that some of them are not yours, mm -hmm. so you can't explain, but we'll just look at the paintings, because I really want to try and get them all in. Okay, okay? no problem. All right, so yeah. what, where we can, do you want to start? Can, we can start. Right here? Okay. This is a. Uh, this is a beautiful painting. Uh, this is you? Yeah, it's 2012 collection. Uh-huh. And uh, I call it Loving Faces. Loving Faces? Loving Faces. Loving Faces. Ah, yeah. Yeah. that's wonderful. That's right. Mm. Uh, it's done through mixed media. Uh -huh. I incorporate different materials like the uh, fabrics. Yes. And uh, I use, uh, um, you know, different textures mm. that shows the strength of, uh, you know, love and stuff. Wonderful. Mm -hmm. I, uh, I use, uh, you know, washes, and this, some of these has been done by uh, like palette knife strokes. Uh -huh. And uh, yeah, it's that's what it is. And one thing is that uh, I'm self-taught painter. You're self-taught. Yeah, I started mm. the journey of painting when right. I was young. Wonderful. Like since 2005, yeah. I started doing it like professionally. That's great. And up to this stage, I'm very excited and honored to come and exhibit my work. Right. So yeah, this is a spread. gift from God. That's right. Yes, uh -huh. I can connect with that because mm -hmm. that's what my, my writing is all about. Okay, now, okay, yeah. Mm -hmm. Now, is this one of yours? Uh, this is another artist called oh. uh, Jugo. Want to come a, over here? He's from, uh, from, he's from um, the art co-op. Mm -hmm. Ah, mm -hmm. and it's, it's beautiful. it looks like two children playing, am two, I right? Yeah, that's right. Mm -hmm. There's two children playing soccer. It's ah. called soccer time. Ah, soccer time. Yes, yeah. that's very good. I love it. I love it. I love it. Okay, now, this one. This one is also made by me. Um, it's called Sweet Melody. It's one of the paintings that um, I did and uh, I really enjoyed working on it. Because yes. I incorporate like music materials mm -hmm. yes, done I see by, that. Uh, by fabrics and, uh, you know, uh, African batik. Mm -hmm. uh, so I embed that into um, to the canvas with strong okay. textures and palette knife strokes and a few splashes like washes and they give it a good uh, a good you know vibrant. It's amazing how much you get in. Exactly. That's, that's, that's unbelievable. What that's what I'm talking about. Yes, that's wonderful. Enjoy wonderful. the process. Yeah. Enjoy the process. <laughs> so do you, do you have any idea when you start what you're gonna? Well, I get a. Yeah, sometimes I get the idea, mm -hmm. I try to work on it, try to extract it, but as I get in the middle, I enjoy the process more, okay. and I add on and add on, and finally I come up with a beautiful um, product. Wonderful, mm -hmm. all right, all yeah. right. Now how so about this one? This one is called Spectators, it's more like an abstract. And this, um, is, this is yours also? Yeah, it's current, it's 2012, one. it's one of the... Um, paintings that I felt like I need to bring to Charlottesville. On this trip I have two different uh, exhibitions coming up, mm -hmm. one in Connecticut, another one in Boston, and then another one uh, in, in Portland, wow. Oregon. So I did exclusive uh, different paintings in different uh, exhibitions. So I really enjoyed working on this one and I, I thought it would be a good presentation in uh, Charlottesville yeah, exhibition. We're in Connecticut. Oh, uh, it's Southport, Southport oh, okay. Galleries. Yeah, I'm from Connecticut. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. That's wonderful. So now, I see this has more black. Mm -hmm. And yeah. why did you choose that? You know, it's sometimes as an artist, you feel, uh, I feel like I don't have any limit to use any color. Uh, as I'm on the journey learning how to use colors and use different materials, I take any decision of using like two colors ah. and see how we can give an effect. Right. So I play along with it, and uh, yeah, sometimes I, I, I really uh, like the finishing part. Wonderful. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah. What happened to, what happened so, 
This is, this is another one of yours. Yeah, it's made out of little mixed media. And I, these are figures. Mm -hmm. This is more like music. Uh, ah, yes. Oh, I see. I see, yes. I was, uh, I was inspired by this one after watching a movie. It was a ah. musical movie. It's uh, American called Cadillac Records. Cadillac Records. Oh, okay. Uh, it was more like, yeah. Wonderful. I enjoyed the band and everything, so. I, Excellent. I, it's Cause, very conceptual. Yes, yes. Because when you, when I first saw this, mm -hmm. at first I didn't get the figures, and then all of a sudden I was like, mm -hmm. "Oh my God, these are musicians!" That's right. <laughs> yeah, that this one is special. That yes. one is special. Yes. This, way. this yes. one is just into it. Wonderful. Yeah, wonderful. It's, yeah, it's something interesting. Okay, um, now. Um, yeah. Another one of yours. Yeah, this is also my own 2012 collection. It's really, really good. I really like doing that. The most exciting part was doing these textures. Yes. And uh, it's really beautiful. It's one of my paintings that, you know, like once you sell it, you still like feel like you, you need it. You know what? Yes. Yeah, so it's sold <laughs> so out. Right you... now, it shouldn't be here. Ah, but, that's uh, wonderful. It's, it's a really strong painting that, you know, re also represents the strength and the advancement of my art Your skills. Art. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Mm. And another one of Emmanuel. Yeah, this this is also another one, but it's more abstract. Yeah, there's more structure in this one. That's right. Yeah. Um, it's yeah. really good one. It's, uh, I haven't figured out the title, special <laughs> title, because it can distract the painting. Uh, but uh, it's really beautiful painting. Wonderful. Mm. Yes, 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 yes. Mm. All right. So this is. This is Kyla Chadwa, who's one of the artists as okay, well that I work with. Okay, um, and he's he's back home. He's back home. Uh -huh. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, he did that, that one. Very nice. I see a biker. Oh, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so proud of myself that I can figure them out. Yeah. Because they're abstract, but they're really incredible. That's right. But I see the bikers. Mm -hmm. That's awesome. Well, they didn't explain his painting as ah. well. Now this is yours. Yeah. I remember that. Can you explain this one to me? Well, this, uh, I call this painting the, um, the source of, um, of wisdom. Wisdom, yeah. ah. It's, um, when you see the center, there is a lot of going on and on the other side. But when you come to this side and the other one, like twists your... Twists you, know, you around. Your mind is doing a lot of work. Huh? Your, yes. Yeah, your eyes. So I grew the inspiration, the inspirations for right. the dynamic rhythm of nature and colors plus the texture. Wonderful. How do you get the patience to just, I mean, I'm looking at all of this. It seems to me like it's just a splash. But yeah. you, I know you have an idea in your head, but it's just amazing how you get it and then it comes out with this beautiful array of colors. It's yeah. wonderful. wonderful. Excellent. And you call this? The source of wisdom. Source of wisdom. Yeah. Very good. I like that one very much. Mm -hmm. And this is another painting? Yeah. This is another one. Um, okay. Mm -hmm. And another one of Emmanuel's. Yeah. Ones. These are like original pants. Like I see jeans. pants, yes. <laughs> Some, sometimes I, I used to put money in here. Uh-huh. And uh, when I was doing an exhibition, I came, I tried to check my money. I couldn't <laughs> find it. But yeah, for some reason, I put the business cards. So, All right. Yeah, it's that's really good. Really incredible. Yeah, yeah, I enjoyed working on this one as well. Yeah, it's called the comfort zone. Comfort zone, yes. Yeah, the comfort zone uh, shows how comfort people should mm -hmm. be in life. And the pants plays a big role in trying to uh, demonstrate the content of the painting. Right. That's yeah. very, very interesting. Yeah. Now, this is the one that really. I couldn't get over this. Mm -hmm. To me, it looks like a splash of lots and lots of people. Is That's that right. true? That's true. You got it right. Ah. Mm. But how in the world can you get it? It's just amazing to me. It is. Because yeah. when you're walking toward it, all you see is a splash of color. That's right. Then all of a sudden, you look at it and you say, wait a minute. Mm -hmm. This is pe These are people. Yeah. It's wonderful. It is. Yes, yes. And this is done by who? By an artist called Tony from Rwanda. Ah. Mm. 
That was incredible. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That one grabbed me. <laughs> That's right. It's really good. It's yes. really, really good. Yes. The same applies to the young girl. Ah, yes. And in this one, I saw lighter colors. Mm -hmm. And I was feeling like there was a crowd watching somebody or just being together. Mm -hmm. And there's, there's a lot of joy in it. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's fascinating. That's right. Fascinating. Mm -hmm. yeah. And this one? This one is also some, some of my... You know, I'm beginning to get your style. That's right. And I knew, I said, this has got to be his too. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's one of our, <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Yeah, one of my latest. Uh-huh. Yeah, this is 2012. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That one sold out as well. All right, that's yeah. wonderful. Yeah. Oh, excellent. Uh, from our art teachers who were really critical, I was happy that they had to criticize and finally get it. That's wonderful. So it's, Excellent. Um, it was so educational. Yes. Mm -hmm. And different other artists. This is another and there's lots of are there bikes. lots of bikers at Rwanda? Yeah, it plays a big role in our really? public transportation. Ah, okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that was also happening. It's something that you you wouldn't think about. You know, when I think about Africa I don't think you about don't. people traveling on on yeah, bikes. You know? Yeah. One thing you shouldn't think about is mainly like the Railway station, like you know, metro, that kind of thing. But the bikes, the taxi, yeah, yeah, those you find a lot. Ah, wonderful. The main buses, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Now, this is yours. Yeah. Ah, look at the work on this. It's called the love of the game. The love of the game. Yeah. Mm. Do you do you play golf? I like I like the the. the how the the golfers think. Ah, yeah, yes. How they use the small ball to get in the distance. Yeah. My father played golf mm -hmm. back when my when blacks weren't allowed to be on the golf field. Yeah. My aunt Hilda, who I'm named after, she played golf also, and yeah. that was unusual because she was black and she was a woman. Yeah. She was quite good, uh, but I. I can kind of feel them with this. I never got into golf, but I really like this whole painting. Now, how did you manage to get these little teeny tiny little splashes? Um, I used the materials from the nature sticks, little uh -huh. sticks, where I, uh, I start with uh, a dark color to the light color. Yeah. Wonderful. Yeah. So. You can really feel that. Yeah. Yeah. That's great. Okay. And this one here, mm -hmm. this looks like the one on the bike. This is uh, the same artist for the bike. But when I when I looked at this one, mm -hmm. all I could see was my ancestors uh -huh. being needing the boat. Yeah. And not knowing what was going to come. Okay. That was my feeling. That can be true. <laughs> Yeah, I, I, that one that one grabbed me. Mm -hmm. You know, I thought my ancestors greeted folks, and then they were taken advantage of. Yeah. Yeah, that one kind of gets me. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's quite. I, I just feel like there's a story there. There's a story. I can't tell the story since I'm not the artist. Right. But it's, uh, one of them, a beautiful painting. Yes, it is. Yeah, yeah, I really like. <sighs> and this is another painter from Rwanda. Yeah. And this is a mommy with her baby. That's true. Yeah. Mm. Wonderful. Wonderful. Mm. Excellent. Excellent. And here we have another one of these creative explanations. Mm -hmm. I'm like, mm -hmm. is this dancing music? Yeah. It's musical. That's what I thought, mm -hmm. yeah. Amazing how much you get on one canvas. That's true. Amazing. Incredible. This is dancing, yes. Mm -hmm. mm. <laughs> <laughs> I love to dance. <laughs> and Emmanuel, that's you. Yeah, that's uh -huh. true. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yes, I see the fish. Mm -hmm. 
Those are some of the tiny pieces of fish in here. Yes, and this is sailboat. That's yeah. right. Yeah, I call it fishing day. It's fishing day. Yeah, it's a, it's a beautiful piece. Yeah, my, uh, my ex-husband loved to fish. Okay. The, the one disadvantage for me was that he would never clean the fish, so when I got, when he got home, I had to clean the fish. <laughs> <laughs> but it was good, fresh fish. I, okay. loved, I loved the fish he brought home. But I, I like that one very much. Mm. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Okay, we're getting near the end here. Okay. Now let's see what we have here. Um, this is another artist from Rwanda. Right. That's right. Mm -hmm. Now I have a, a pattern. I have a skirt with this pattern. For real? Mm -hmm. Nice. Yeah. yeah. I have a lot of uh, African you know, material, and I, when on my show I usually have African material, mm -hmm. and I wear African. Okay. Stuff. Yeah. Okay. So that, I, when I saw that, I remember. This is another one from? Yeah, it shows the public transportation and the ah. city scene. That's really beautiful. You can and, get a film of Africa. And you do you have buildings at all? Yeah. Wonderful. Mm -hmm. Wonderful. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this is... I got a feeling of I was there. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, that's yeah. true. I was there. This mm -hmm. is wonderful. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And uh, these, I noticed that they have, they're very similar. So yeah. he's, is he showing two sides of the street? Or yeah, two sides. Two sides. But, but in, you know, like, it's like those things when you're in New York City, yes. you go like on the 7th Avenue, but if you, you know, like 53rd Street, 54th Street, like different part, different parts of streets. Ah, it's that, that, uh -huh. that kind of thing. Yes, mm -hmm. yes. So here you have lots of of uh -huh. automobiles, and here you have more people. That's true. Yeah, yeah. It's very good. Mm -hmm. Love it. Mm -hmm. It's amazing what you what comes out of your mind. I have a daughter who is an artist, mm -hmm. and I can I'm always amazed at what what you create. Exactly, you know, <laughs> there's a bunch, there's in a, in a kind of message yes. that usually is being portrayed on a small piece of canvas <laughs> and you can see a broader perspective of something yeah. that one is thinking about. Right. Yeah, that's what uh, makes art very interesting. So this is another one of you? Yeah, this is another one of me. So. Now this one I couldn't figure out. This is called swimming. It's ah, like people swimming. But, okay. You know, more now that you said it, I got yeah, it. <laughs> yeah. It's really a beautiful painting mm -hmm. that I, I played a big role enjoying and enjoying walking on it. Do you get to go swimming very often? Yes, I do. Yeah. Yeah. I'm playful. I do all kind of things. One thing I don't do is playing uh, American football. Oh, you don't? <laughs> but I wish, you know, because we don't have American football. No, so, yeah. and this one here, mm -hmm. yeah, is this yours? Yeah, that's my one. All right. And what were you thinking when you decided to do this one? Yeah, well, I guess what I, I wanted to portray peace and hope and uh, redemption in my kind of work. Ah. But I, I haven't gotten any specific name, name okay. for the entire piece. But you're saying that you wanted to uh, express yeah. peace and, and uh, yeah. redemption. Yeah. And I, I am assuming that that's a big important part in your life yeah. with what Rwanda went through. Yeah, that's yeah. right. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. and, um, Wow, this is, this is incredible. Mm -hmm. um, one of the things I wanted to ask both of you is that you have a, an organization called Artists with Mission. Yeah. Okay? Mm -hmm. And um, you, you deal with children in the orphanage yeah. and you help them to learn how to paint or That's you true. just let them go at it? Yeah, yeah, I help them. Yeah? Yeah. And so yeah, Art to the Mission is mainly a program that I started alongside with uh, other artists, but art is helping. Innocent works closely with me. It's a, it's a program mainly to educate orphans who don't have 
our parents. Right. They lost their parents, some in the genocide, others, you know, different uh, history. But using art as something like can bring hope to their lives. Yes, yes, that's yeah. amazing. Mm -hmm. uh, this is, comes along with uh, the fact that we don't have art scene, like professional art scene in Rwanda in sense of like education as far as education is concerned. And art with the mission plays a big role uh, to help and train professionally kids that they can use art as a thing that can bring hope to their lives right. uh, by attaining education, you know, medication at the same time, but mainly focusing on painting and we provide space where they sell art and that can also support their essential basic uh, needs, you know, That's like wonderful. covering the yeah. basic essential needs. So how many children do you have at, at one time coming? Uh, well, we take classes twice, you know, so it takes once in a week, at, uh, like twice, we both take twice a week. Twice a week? Twice a week, and uh, we take different classes ranging from the early, early learners, um, teaching them all the painting uh, skills we got, we know, mm. like from the learning stage drawing all the way, all the way down to uh, paint, you know, painting, stretching compasses and, and all that. For now, the, the stage that they are, used, they are now on is to paint, like um, do professional painting. Wonderful. But at the same time, we're trying to incorporate different other medias, like doing photography, video, which requires financial sweat, and this is what we're working on. Most of the time, all the paintings that we sell, money get, we get, help us to support the program. Wonderful. Mm -hmm. Now, is there a way to get in touch with you? Well, yeah, you can get in touch with me. Okay, yeah. how? Can you, you give can, us your, uh, your email? Yeah, my email address, my website. I got okay. a website, it's all active right. running. Uh, you can get in touch with me on emmanuelmoranga.com. Okay. Um, Can you spell the last name? Yeah, it's E double uh, Emmanuel. It's E double M A N U E L. Uh -huh. Moranga. It's N K U R A N G A. Dot com. C O. Yes. <laughs> got that. I'm sure. And how about you? Do you have a website? Yeah, my website is Morosism. In uh, Morosism.com. Can you spell it for us? N K U R A U. N Z I Z A R T. Wow, yeah. this has been Good awesome. Time. I really appreciate can having. Can you talk about what you do? Um, yeah, what do you do? I um, I started a program for women. Ah. Uh, whereby it's it's a collective of women. Mm -hmm. uh, it's called Nziza. It's, it's a word from my name. Uh huh. For my son, M. Right. These are art, art, artworks. So mm -hmm. these are the women that I, I live in them in my neighborhood, mm -hmm. and they don't have enough support to right. sustain their ch their children, children and their yes. families. So by doing that, I teach them how to. I empower them to mm -hmm. art yes. innovations. Mm. by teaching them how to use different materials to create beads. Ah, yes. Yeah, oh. and gametes, plastic mm. styles. Right. So all that, yeah, all, those, uh, all those activities that they make, they bring uh, an economic resource to Absolutely. their Absolutely, yes, yeah. that's wonderful, yeah. wonderful. So that's how, <sighs> that's how we give back to the give community. Give back to the community, that's yeah. right. And I, I'm so happy and so proud to get to meet both of you because the fact that you are doing this, it's, it's from the heart and yeah. just, I, I am so excited mm -hmm. and I hope we'll stay in touch because I'd really love to find out more about what's going on and mm -hmm. how it's going with you. Okay, is there anything you want to say? Because we only have two minutes left. Uh, I just want to inform all the Shouts people uh -huh. that we have a show called A Thousand Hills. A, a Thousand uh, Hills. A Thousand Hills from uh -huh. Rwanda. 
Right. It's a Magafi Art Center running through this month up to yes, yes. the 25th of um, Is it the 25th of November? Yeah, Is it? Right. It's over? Okay. Yeah. Wonderful. Come on so, down. The artwork is incredible. Please come and be, be with these two gentlemen. I really am so excited to have a chance to talk to both of you. Thank you. So wonderful, much. wonderful.